All right, the topic is Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving is still one of the very few, tiny few uh, professional athletes who refuse to get vaccinated, right? Um, and we have some support. We have some people coming in support of Kyrie Irving. Uh, here we have Floyd Mayweather, very famous uh, boxer. So let's go ahead and uh, listen to what Flo has to say. Kyrie, what's up? I know you're going through a lot. We had a chance to hang out in 2016 when you represented America, when you represented the red, white, and blue. You only want to be treated fair. Um, I was going to post something on one of my social media pages, but I decided to do it the old school way old school. and read it out to you because you're a great person, great father, a uh, great athlete, and you believe what you believe. America is the land of the free. Freedom of speech, freedom of religion, and supposedly freedom to choose. Never be controlled by money. I respect you for having some integrity and being your own man. A free mind makes its own choices. An enslaved mind follows the crowd. Stand for something or fall for anything. One man can lead a revolution to stand up and fight for what's right. One choice, one word, one action can change the world. It's crazy how people hate you for being a leader. I hope your actions encourage many others to stand up and say enough is enough. Respect to you, Kyrie, and power to the people. A leader, is Kyrie Irving a leader? Mm, well, he's standing for everybody who lost their job. That's what he said in this recent um, comments regarding uh, the vaccine, the vaccine mandate. So yeah, you can say he's a leader because he's trying to be a voice for a lot of people right now that are losing their job, which is totally awful. How can you stand and watch people losing their job and just be okay with it because I don't know, you are vaccinated. So for you, it's okay. That's that's just wrong, right? That's just wrong. So I like that Flo May Mayweather is coming in support of Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving, um, a lot of people are talking about him right now, the whole NBA, ESPN, a lot of politicians. So do you think Floyd Mayweather speech here or support, do you think it's because of cloud or do you think he's sincere about it? Let me know in the comment section. I wanted to say also, it's crazy what's happening with that whole situation because if you think about it, it's not about saving life anymore. No, it's not about that because here is a funny fact. Bradley Beal is also a basketball player. He played for the Washington, uh, I think the Washington Wizard. And Bradley Beal is not vaccinated. But Bradley Beal can go to Brooklyn and play against the Brooklyn Nets without any problem. He's not vaccinated, he can play against the Brooklyn Nets and go back to Washington, right? But Kyrie Irving cannot when they are basically the same. They're like in the same situation when you talk about the vaccine mandate. And that's kind of crazy. It's all politics. And the, the worst thing for a politician, because this is all about politics, and politician wants you to believe the thing that they are here to protect you, right? The worst thing for a politician is you, a human being, coming and telling them to their face, I don't need you. You are here, you are elected because you can make my life better or a little bit harder easier or a little bit harder, but I don't need you, all right? I see you in four years when we elect the president. That is the worst nightmare for a politician, in my opinion. So what do you think about uh, Floyd Mayweather here? And what do you think about the whole vaccine mandate with the, the NBA? Um, do you agree with Floyd Mayweather? Do you stand with Carrie? Let me know in the comment section.